thanks for being here. Thanks a lot. No, thank you for having us out. And, um, does this uh, and sound okay? Yeah, okay, we'll, great. We'll, we'll also come out next Tuesday as well. Perfect. To cover thanks. Thanks a well. lot. Great. So, um, Beautiful. Congratulations. Thank you. On thanks a, a lot. Wonderful opening night. Thank you. Thanks a lot. And uh, my kudos to you on a very very good piece that you were in. Thank you. Uh, thanks. The Ringer, yeah. Right? Yeah. Yeah. The Ringer. Um, how was it to finally get to perform that for an audience? Um, I, I love that show, and uh, it, it's uh, and I have a wonderful co-star, the two of us, myself and Jacob Waddell, who is um, ten years old, and the two of us are out here for about I don't know ten twelve minutes together, mm -hmm. and it's a very dark little tale, and I'm so proud of him, I really am, because the first day of rehearsal, I remember saying to him, "Hey, Jacob, you know what? I'm going to have to like." yell at you during this piece, but I want you, don't be scared or anything. It's just, yeah, I'm not really yelling at you. It's just uh, the two characters we're playing. And he was like, oh yeah, yeah, I understand. And he's the most <laughs> phenomenally great actor to be on stage with. He's just terrific. I'm yeah, so proud of him. the piece gets very, very intense. It um, does get a little intense. Actually, I was yeah. really surprised at how many of the pieces had a real heavy intensity to yeah. them yeah, yeah. Um, across the night. Yeah, um, you know, especially uh, Kaleidoscope. Yeah, Kaleidoscope's a whole other beast. Obviously, that's a very, very different. I mean, that's Bradbury, which is about mm -hmm. as fantastic as it gets. Uh, but yeah, it's been a really interesting experience, I got to say. But but it's been a, 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 I've had a lot of hats on in this thing, and uh, I've been able to sort of occasionally take the producer hat off and actually go into the rehearsal hall and be an actor again. And and uh, I started out doing plays in New York, so I'm very, very, very happy to be doing one again. It's really, it's lovely. It's a lovely experience to perform in front of an audience. Well, and you hear people say oftentimes that LA is not a good uh, theater town, mm -hmm. um, but the crowd here tonight was fantastic. They were, they were absolutely terrific. And I've heard little birdie talking to me on the wire that uh, ticket sales are going pretty well. And they are, they are indeed. And, uh, you know, I, I think that's fantastic. It is what you're doing fantastic. here is amazing. Thank you. Uh, yeah, we are we are hoping that everybody gets on the stick and buys tickets while they still can because we're running for a month. Uh, but you know that'll that's going to go by fast. So <laughs> please, you know, if anybody, if any of your viewers are watching right now, by all means, grab the tickets now. If you snooze, you lose. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Brian and I started out in theater uh -huh. um, as techs, right? And uh, we were both marveling at the kind of multimedia presentation. Thank and you. All of the the technical wizardry that went into producing all the shows. Thank tonight. you. How, uh, how hard was it to come up with the inspirations for all of that? And, and how big was the team that worked on all the different shows? Well, I got to tell you, we, we have been unbelievably blessed since this project first kind of came out of the box. It's been almost like a magnet in that it's attracted really everything that it's needed. And one of the things that we said early on is, wow, we have to have a great design team to pull this off. And the people who signed up for like basically like no money. <laughs> stage money. <laughs> it, it, like stage money, exactly. It's been phenomenal. And uh, it, straight across the board, uh, I, I mean, I, I could kind of roll through all these names, but I would, I'm sure I'd forget somebody. But what I want to say is it, it, it's been this A team of designers that have come on board to make this happen. So uh, I'm, I'm astounded by what we've, what we've pulled together here and how beautiful it looks and the work that's gone into it. And Unbelievably, they're not done yet because we're doing Evening B. One week from tonight, we open Evening B, which is a whole new set of five new plays. Mm -hmm. So we're we're unbelievably thrilled with the response. It's really fantastic. Yeah, it it, uh, it was such an innovative use of projection and plasma screens and pretty cool, huh? Blending all that. That in. kaleidoscope's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah, kaleidoscope was amazing. Yeah, pretty amazing what he's Absolutely done. Absolutely amazing, that. and such a performance piece for the actors. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, we talked about it being kind of gravity for the stage. Yeah. Um, and it really came across that way. I, I was completely sold. They were in space. They were all moving away from it's pretty amazing, isn't it? Um, yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. The performance we, is all around. Uh, you know, Pat Town, I salute him. Uh, when, he's the director of that piece. Uh, because when, when we first chose to do it, I said, well, we got to find somebody who's going to take this on and take the ball all the way down the field. <laughs> and he really did. I mean, he really, really did. There's, it's no easy thing to float people in space right. without the use of wires. And he's done an amazing, amazing job with it. Yeah, it's fantastic. And it's also really a compelling play because every time, I, every time I've seen it, even in rehearsal, I found it really moving. I mean, just it, it, the writing alone is so beautiful. It's just, I don't know, it just kind of floats on Ray Bradbury's language, which is yeah. always so phenomenal. It's very poetic. It's yeah. very, um, 
it was written a long time ago, but very it's, long it's time still ago. very current and very astoundingly because it is it is about death, which is universal. Yeah, we all face yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We all face it in our own way. Yeah, it's a it's a really interesting question that it sort of asks, which is what how would you spend your last moments? Mm -hmm. What would you do in the last moments of your life? So it's it's pretty amazing. It's an amazing piece. Yeah, I'm, I thank you so much for bringing it to the stage. It's been a complete pleasure. And I didn't do it by myself, by the way. An incredible team of people brought this to the stage tonight. And I'm so proud to be a part of it. And, and it's just been astounding, the artists that we have doing on this. It's amazing. So uh, you're starting to look forward to next year now? Sure. I'm already <laughs> thinking about next year. You bet. <laughs> you bet I am. Because this is year one this of is many, year many one. years to come. We got, we got much bigger things coming up. You bet. It's been amazing. Great. And thanks for being here. No, thank you for having us out. Okay. All right.